welcome back to the channel welcome back to the vlog of course from the beautiful sunshine state of florida as usual so if you're checking this video out you know today is thursday and you know what comes with thursday tool time thursday let me get you in focus there a little bit there you guys go um today what i'm gonna go over is i'm gonna go over one of my most used impact tools that i have You'd think I don't use this as much as I do, but I actually use this a lot. And it's actually my Matco quarter inch drive um, impact. It's a 12 volt system, 20 amp fridge. Um, I guess what's called it, Infinitium air battery system. Has a little battery checker capacity on there. Works great. If you need a, a part number, this is the part number right here. Um, as I said, it looks pretty beat up to me because I actually use this a whole lot. This is one of the ones I use the most. It do come with this little rubber padding to help um, minimize scuffing and wear on it. But as you can see, that wears down. It's coming off right here. And then you can see the little um, scratching on this. This right here is metal. And same thing on this side, not as bad, not as wore down on this side. Um, on mine, I put a little arrow on there to just give me a little quick reverse forward. Um, I think my forward arrow um, erased, but I got the reverse. Just something quick in a pinch. If I have somebody who's, um, I tell them, hey, pass me this, this like, I make sure it's in forward or reverse, I'll say, just look at the arrow. You got good torque on it. Um, as you can see, I'm gonna use it and tighten my wheel bolts up um, for my three-piece wheels. But as I said, this um, it's pretty twerky. I'm not sure what the what it torques down to, but if I find that out, I'll put that in the comment down below. But as I said, I really, really love this, and I use it the most out of all my other impact guns that I have. And it usually, for the quarter inch drive, it usually breaks everything um, that I need to. You see it has a little light on it. Um, sometimes it comes in handy. Sometimes I don't think. It only comes in handy if it's really dark, because if it's a little bit of sun, you rarely see that little light. But if it's dark, while you're trying to reach down, you'll see. It has this little ring on it to help hold the, the socket on. Um, sometimes you know, they're hard to um, get on with that little ring, but I think this ring um, could be spread out a little bit more because it's really, I'm not really using that much pressure and I could get the, um, the quarter inch off. So usually if that ring is out a little bit more, it'll be harder to get this off, especially if you're working down on something and you pull it off, you don't want um, the socket to come off with it. But all in all, one of my most used guns over all the other guns that I do have as far as um, uh, usage wise. Um, I have the 3.8s, um, the 3.8s Snap-on, which I use um, if this can't break it loose and I don't want to do it by hand, um, I'll just use the, the 3.8s gun and then just use this to just finish it up so i went and got my um my 3 8 impact cordless of course um you can see it's almost it's not almost the same size but this has a narrower bottom end to kind of get in and smaller to get into a couple of more tight spaces than the snap-on um 3 8 and it's a lot lighter um, this is one that I would definitely, definitely recommend. You wouldn't think you would need a quarter inch impact, but you do, and you'll get a lot of usage out of this quarter inch impact. Um, I'm not saying that you won't get as much out of this, but I say I like to go with this one. Um, it's lighter. I do have two batteries for it, um, but of course you're not torquing anything down. Um, with this one, you still would have to go back and check it with a 
uh, torque wrench or your arm, make sure it's good and tight to German specs. But definitely recommend this. It may not, it may not be a Matco. It could be a Snap-on. It could be a Milwaukee. It could be a Cobalt. It's whatever you like. Whatever your budget um, allows you to do. I like Matco and Snap-on, so that's what I'm gonna buy because that's what my budget allowed me to buy. I know there's cheaper stuff out there, but this is my preference. Just like you have a preference to go with whichever um, gun you want to go with or whichever brand you want to go with. That's the good thing about the USA. You have many, many choices. So again, thank you guys for checking out the channel, checking out another Tool Time Thursday. Definitely hit the bell icon. Ding! <laughs> uh, subscribe, hit, tap the subscribe button like share and comment on the videos and till the next two time thursday thanks for watching peace